so good morning guys here today saturday is a day where i'm washing my gs 1250 2021 model we got recent a ride of money to panya kumari you can see how badly the bike has become dirty everywhere you can see bug splatter and uh, it was a rainy day, so a lot of mud and grime on the engine, every other place. In there on all bodo is to Monday Gri the La Kadenta. So the goal today is to clean it, make it look like new and uh, wash the bike. So use the bug and tar remover on the places where there's a lot of bug spray, bug splatter. So you glass so the luck clean marana by there. So this is a product from Wavex like I mentioned earlier. Uh, and once it doesn't have a great pleasant odor but uh, the product does its job, so as in half bit two, we need to let it soak for a couple of minutes and then you can immediately notice when I wish to splatter and you can immediately start uh, cleaning that through a detailing brush. So that is what we are going to do now. I am just using this wherever I see some bugs, I am not using it anywhere, I am cautiously Applying it. I think that's where most of the things were. In uh, the some bird dropping. This should remove all of that. Let's get to action.
uh, I finished using the bug and tar remover and removed most of the bug splashes um, that was there on the bike and uh, the bike looks already much better now. Um, you can see in most of the places uh, the bug uh, splatter has all gone. Um, now uh, I'm using the iron fallout remover and I'm going to use this only in rough places like uh, near brake calipers, uh, suspension, uh, at the front end tip here to some places because those are the places, um, radiator cover guard, so those are the places where you will get a lot of um, uh, iron particles stuck. Um, you can also directly put it on the paint uh, but I don't think there's much of it but some of these areas is where I'll be using the iron uh, fallout remover. So money spray marna, this also requires a lot of time uh, to uh, activate, get activated and uh, it doesn't smell that great as well. So but as long as if it's doing its job, I'm okay. So these are some of the places where the road grime directly comes and gets uh, accumulated. So wheels go out there, I have a separate wheel trim cleaner and uh, some of them may use this after a foam wash so i am using it before because i want to do get rid of all the basic contaminants first so that's how some of people will do but it's a uh, each one follows a different way of looking at this i'm expecting it to Turn purple, so you see these are exposed pannier bags. So you can have for those. There's a lot of grime exhaust. So you see these are the places where this should really work and pull out most of the dust from there. And again, this product is from Wavex. So I'm using this for the second time. No, no, So we let it sit in here for some five, ten minutes. It takes a lot of time for it to work, and then we can rinse it off. So as expected, not much of iron contamination on the bike. I am not sure if this product is working fine or. Ilandre iron contamination Ilanta. So wherever here you can see purple color agar So I am assuming these are the where places where the product is working more. Uh, and the lella sulfa chelli there do. Wheels that are lella sulfa agar But overall I don't know if it's working 100%. But hello, adu purple agi lasto. And these are the places where it should ideally have a lot of iron contamination or the grime particles coming up from the road and dirt so so far looks good um, so now we'll rinse it off and then uh, move to the next level of washing so ega iron decontamination i do so the next thing that we need to do is uh, on the wheels this Meguiar's product is amazing. Immediate again in uh, hard uh, <coughs> grime This is very good for cleaning the tire as well as the rims. So that's the reason it's hard rims. You can let it sit for a couple of minutes and then we can start getting the work done. Uh-huh. <sighs> 